Are you sick and tired of ads? Are you looking for a reliable ad blocker? Well, today we're going to have a look at Technetium. We're also going to have a look at Piehole, and we're also going to have a look at Ad God. We want to know which is the good ad blocker. So without further ado, let's check them out. All right, we're having a look at Technetium now. And Technetium has advanced DNS apps. So you can actually custom uh, REGEX based block lists for more tailored content filtering. Also, um, it has signaled or signed zones for algorithms and this creates maximum security. It has encrypted DNS protocols and it's got integrated DHCP servers. This is all fantastic. Having a look as well over here, um, it has specialized capabilities. You can actually split your Horizon DS, uh, DNS. Um, you can uh, reduce external queries for faster response times and enhanced privacy with the local DNS cache. And um, you can automate DNS management tasks through comprehensive pragmatic uh, access. Also, it has command line tools. So it's got a powerful uh, command line option for more advanced administrators and um, scripting capabilities. You can see over here, um, it's location-based DNS answers via DNS apps, and it overrides live domain records as needed. It also has a catalog zone, so RFC 9432 implementations for zone management, and it's got record aging. So it automatically removes um, expired records, which is great. Let's jump into Piehole now and um, Piehole is a whole network protection. So this blocks ads at DNS level for all connected devices. Um, it also runs on low cost devices like uh, Raspberry Pi. It has a faster browsing capability by eliminating ad content, and it also stops unwanted content before it actually reaches your device. It has real-time dashboards. Uh, you can see live statistics showing blocked queries and activity. It has multiple trusted sources for comprehensive protection. It excludes specific domains from blocking and the uh, uh, API integration allows you to connect with other services within your network. Also, um, it creates powerful pattern-based blocking rules to catch variations of unwanted domains. That's really clever. Um, you also get backup and restore options for your configuration with ease across all of your installations. You can manage your network addressing alongside DNS filtering, also for complete control, and you can create different blocking policies for various device groups. You can see over here as well, we're having a look now at AdGuard. So um, AdGuard actually offers a desktop app. So it's complete protection for Windows as well as Mac systems with advanced filtering. The iOS and Android app is also fantastic for on the go protection. This is great because you can use this on all of your devices, whether you're using an iPhone, an Android, Windows, it doesn't matter. It's lightweight options such as its browser extension for Chrome, Firefox and other browsers is also a fantastic option. I really do like browser extensions rather than installing applications. You can also see over here that it has HTT PS filtering, which allows you to secure websites for complete protection. It has multi filters um, for blocking malicious sites, and it has content categorization for family safe browsing. And then you also get stealth mode, which prevents digital fingerprinting as well as tracking, which is a little bit like the incognito tab when you jump onto Chrome. The last thing over here you can see is that it has centralized protection, detailed analytics and advanced configuration. So if this is something that you're looking for, then this is absolutely a fantastic option. Now, folks, the takeaway here is to really go out and use the software to see if it actually works for you. If this was helpful, go ahead and drop us a like and we will see you next time.